Hey guys, NST Never Stop Traveling, and today I went to this cave and this historical site uh, south of the sea, or northwest of the Sea of Galilee. This is right after I went to the waterfall. If you missed that video, it's a previous video. I'll put it in the link. I'll put the link in the description box below. Um, after I went from that waterfall, I went to this cave, which is the location you see on the screen, little blue dot, and then I went south to the Jordan River. And in the following video, I went to some historical site. It's pretty cool. So if you guys want to check these out, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And um, hope you enjoy the video. Peace. So I'm on this walk, trying to find this cave. And I found a bunch of cows. Little moo-moos. Moo! I mean, I found all their cow pies everywhere I've been walking. A huge animal. Just checking me out. Hey, buddy. He's like, I don't know how I feel about this guy. Keeping an eye on you. His buddy's up there. Alright, I'm gonna go do my thing. Alright, so we're gonna try to get a good view of this, this cave here. It's not very big, it looks big from your perspective. Let me go in there and check it out. I can get in here. It's super small. This is a bunch of these. Small. You guys in here, check it out. Yeah. Same thing as the other one. Oh, the lighting's actually pretty good. Yeah. Looks like an old dwelling, either an old grave site. So I'm out here enjoying the beautiful weather of Golan Heights. This place is super cool. I uh, showed you the, the waterfall over here. There's a bunch of little waterfalls and streams and the Jordan River that goes into the Sea of Galilee. I'm gonna try to show you guys a good, good view of that out here the foothills. Um, they got a lot of these little dwelling places, little caves and whatnot. I don't know if they were grave sites or if they were Now this guy, this behind me, this is a, a closer view of the Sea of Galilee. It's pretty cool. You know, in land. It's really just a lake. I mean, if you're from Chicagoland, you've been up to Lake Geneva. Lake Geneva is vastly larger than this lake. I mean, this is like a chunk of Lake Geneva. It's still cool though, I mean, it's the sea, but I know there's a lot of historical stuff that you can tie to the Sea of Galilee and I don't know when you're reading through the Bible or the Quran or whatever. I don't think that is in the Quran. There's a lot of history you can tie to the Sea of Galilee. I mean a lot of stories and the, and the Gospels and whatnot. So it's kind of a cool, really cool sight to see. As you can see behind me, this is one of the other sites they believe that Jesus was baptized. 
is the site here, and there's another site uh, south of here, just north of the Dead Sea. Uh, yeah, I believe it's just north of the Dead Sea. The, uh, the Jordan River goes around it, and there's a site there that actually one side of the river is on the Jordan side, and one side is on the Israeli side, and they that's also a very famous baptism site. But this is right off the Sea of Galilee, so I'm assuming it's more of a kind of a tourist trap. Uh, location. It's much more beautiful. I mean, the water here is a lot bluer, super clean. A lot of people here were baptized because it is the same river that you know Jesus was baptized in or whatever. But um, there might be more than the two sites, but definitely, at least definitely two sites that they check out or that they believe that uh, he was baptized at. Let's see if we can go check out over here. I'm gonna try to find a good fishing spot. Definitely wanna come back here with Jake, and do some good fishing. Yeah, if you, if you didn't see any of our other videos, me and Jake did some uh, exploring Massad and Sea of Galilee. I'll put those attachments in the, in the description box. Yeah, just a bunch of videos that are describing you know, some of the sites and stuff. We're showing some of the sites around Israel. Alright, so this is how, this is how I kind of get it going. I found a reed. It feels kind of like a soft bamboo. I'm going to take this guy. And then in my wallet, I always keep with me, I showed you guys earlier, I took me to one of these cards. And in this card, I'll have uh, like a, a needle and some thread, a hook, a hook and some, uh, some line. I take this line, try to get it untangled. You want some food, don't you? Yes, I do. I don't got any food. Well, give it to me. All right, that was just uh, just another cat, and this was my adventure throughout um, throughout the Sea of Galilee, the Jordan River, and then you know seeing the sites where Jesus was baptized, finding a good fishing spot, and then Bet Shean really cool site um it's really really relaxful day nothing too crazy in this video but hope you guys liked it um if you guys did there's a bunch more videos that i make of my travels and a bunch of how to travel hacks and whatnot uh everything should be in the description box or you can go to my channel all right guys well this is my sister's art hopefully you guys check it out it's pretty cool stuff otherwise peace out nst never stop traveling